seven straight wins, first time since 2018. And tonight, y'all did it, not with the long ball, but with a sack fly here, a bunt there. It was pretty impressive. Yeah, yeah. Uh, good job of small ball by the guys. Uh, Duran got the bunt down. Jankowski put in play. And Jankowski had a great game for not starting. Uh, he let off the inning, got a walk, scored a run, and uh, put the ball in play. And Ornelas, you got to give him credit. He got a great jump there and uh, to score that run. And, you know, we got a break uh, the inning before with that error to tie the game. But it comes down to pitching. We, we, you know, to me, that's still the story. Uh, uh, another quality start uh, by Dane. Uh, six solid innings, and bullpen did a great job. Uh, it was good to come from behind win. Yeah, Will Smith said afterwards that the chemistry is just at an all-time high. That these guys love playing together. Do you feel that from this group? Oh, I do. I do. I think they they care about each other. They're they're, they're taking the field with, a, you know, just a great energy. Uh, you know, they're pulling for each other. Uh, it's fun to watch these guys right now. Last question. Any nerves about putting a guy like Ornelas in? I love that you put him in and he gets to score the winning run. No, I, I didn't have any uh, reservation <laughs> on that. I, I saw him in spring training. He played a lot this spring and and I know he can run the base as well. And uh, again, he got a great jump there uh, uh, on that contact play. Uh, but, you know, he he never showed uh, any fear in spring training or any you know, hesitation of being in big league camp. Uh, I love the way he handles himself, and that's why he's up here right now. All right. Thanks, Butch. Yeah. Did that feel out there tonight? I mean, I know it, you struggled early, but it seems like you had a quick turnaround. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I felt like I kind of cruised to the first two innings and then just kind of uh, lost a little bit of command in that third inning and just got frustrated with myself um, and just had a mishaps in the, you know, on a play and then uh, – just some bad located, not executed pitches that uh, costed us, you know, a couple runs and uh, just just kind of fell off the ball in the third inning a little bit, but was able to get back on the saddle and, and grind out through six. So what did you do? What adjustment did you make? Was it more mental or anything else? Um, I mean, I felt like I was making quality pitches, but after re-watching it, like, per inning, it was, I mean, I was missing probably a ball off just around the zone. So. Um, just wanted to be more consistent in the zone. I just started throwing more inner thirds than, than, than to the corners. Um, just try to fill up as many strikes as I could and then just kind of let the defense work from there. Um, and then um, in that sixth inning, having that leadoff double, just being able to come back and you know, get three outs was, I felt like was crucial. Did you, did you get flustered at all by the misplay? Did they... um, no. Um, like I said, I, I felt like I threw some quality pitches there, and they were just just off, and they had good at bats. And then um, the, um, I think it's how you pronounce it, Gilock or something like that. Um, I threw him a sink. I tried to go sinker in, just left it more middle of the plate, and he handled it well, and just hit a backside double. Uh, we get that throw online, it might be, you know, two runs instead of three, but um, even then, it's that's out of my control. I just, I didn't get that sinker in, and um, he was able to put a good swing on it. And I think that's kind of, um, you know, those walks in that inning is what really hurt me.